just the enjoyment, bro. I want to go home. <laughs> I want to go home now. <laughs> yeah, actually. Yes. Really like you said you said at any point if someone doesn't feel uneasy, we go back. No, I said you go back. I'll give you the keys. <laughs> oh my days, dude. Dude, 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 I want you to feel this, right? Stand, stand right here and put your arm through. Put your arm through. Don't be, just your arm. Is tell me what you feel. Is something going to grab it? No, just put your arm through and tell me Bro. what you feel. Yo. Oh, Yo. Dude. It's, it's so cold. Yeah, I know. What? It's like warm where we're standing and then in there's freezing, dude. That is a frozen jambon. <laughs> Okay, episode two is here. Here we go. We are going to another haunted house. Going to keep it a little bit secret. You already know by the title of where we're going. Uh, but I have to pick up my friend first. He's an hour away. So I have to go pick him up, come back here, pick Dan up, go to the haunted house, stay there for a few hours, and try and get freaked out. That's the goal. So let's go. Uh, yes, yeah, big dog. <laughs> What's good, how are you? I'm alright, big dog. Good to see you. So, we just stopped for pizza first before we go into the haunted house. Look at this. Look, oh. Oh, mate. Mate. Take a bite, big dog. This on camera. Look at that pizza. Oh, bro. Give it a review out of 10, yeah? Yeah. And we'll go back across, bro. Give it a bit of crust, bro. Oh. <laughs> that pizza's a good. 8.1 out of 10. 8.1? Okay. Say? Here, let me try it. Okay. <laughs> Go ahead, big lad. Mm. Yeah, bite the crust there. What do you think of the crust? The crust is pang. You like that? Well, what do you say out of 10? I'm going to give it like a 7, barely. A 6.8. Oh my! 6.8! Bro, I'm just used to like nicer pizza. Like Sorry, it's just isn't it's okay, but it's very like crispy. It's not like nice and doughy, you know what I mean? Let me shut this thing off. Okay guys, so it's been like a couple hours since I last checked in. We haven't left the house yet. We just chilled and had some pizza and like researched this place a little bit more. Turns out this is the one place in Northern Ireland, there's been a few all over Ireland, but in Northern Ireland this is the one place there's been an exorcism done in the last hundred years. So, apparently everything's boarded up and you can't get in, but you can get up to the house and walk around it. Uh, the pathway is meant to be very creepy, but yeah, I'm just going to give you a little bit more in depth of this little speech that I do. Here you go. The cottage that belonged to the widow Murphy has been exposed for the first time in recent history. Traditionally surrounded by creaking foresty trees, the Cunning Ghost House was brought to light recently when the Northern Ireland Forest Service chopped down the surrounding trees. Local ghost expert warned that increased visitors will upset the energy within the house. Famous for a terrifying poltergeist that plagued Bridget Murphy and her seven children by creating loud noises and footsteps in the loft, banging and rapping on the walls, sometimes to the tune of the soldier's song in the boiling water. Throwing plates across the room and lifting the beds off the floors as the children slept, the Cunning Ghost House is believed to be the only house in Ireland in which an exorcism was carried out. The story says that a priest called Father Coyle was given permission for two exorcisms to be performed in the house. They didn't appear to work and the Murphy family decided to emigrate to America in 1913. To their horror, the poltergeist followed them on the ship, but later seemed to disappear. Graham Gunn, who heads the Fermanagh Paranormal Society, told the impartial reporter, ghosts are unable to move or travel over water. However, it's believed it traveled with the family for some time. And now we believe that the poltergeist has returned to the house and lives there to this day. There's the back man himself. Big Cheddar. Big Cheddar 116. Hop in, Big Cheese Dog. No, you, leg room, do you? you don't sit behind me, mate. You see how far my chair is. Dan, you're invisible. Yes. Oh, no, man, jeez. He's been there somewhere. He, he's like right there. Ah, there we go. So, you ready to go get Dan? Yeah. How nervous are you? Are you nervous? I'm tipsy. 
tipsy. Oh yeah, he's had a little beer, so that's <laughs> he's tipsy. Right, anyway guys, we're just about to leave. Let's go, we'll be there in 30 minutes and we'll see you 23. again. She left her body and hovered above me. I saw no shadow, I looked around. Searched every building and home that I found. I saw no shadow, but felt the glow. The warmth inside me kept me afloat. Felt like heaven, I found my bones. And gave me comfort when I feel alone. Now you're gone, I'm alone. So, uh, how far is it away then? Put the window up when you're talking or you'll not be able to hear anything. How far away is it? Um, 25 minutes away. So about 15 miles, around 15 miles. Would you be there by, I would say, a little bit after 10? We'll go in, well, apparently it's very haunted when you get there, so we'll go up the pathway and like go real slow and look around. But yeah, it's gonna be creepy. It's gonna be very creepy. As far as I know, this is gonna be a lot creepier than the last one we did, without a doubt. I know for a fact this is gonna be so creepy. Because, oh, yeah. yeah, because I've looked at all the videos on it, I've looked at the, the picture of the house, I've read up about this. Mate, you're light. I've read up about this and it's just, it's just scary, bro. It's just scary. But anyway, bro, we're here. And I have to be honest, this road has been Genuinely the most terrifying thing. We haven't seen a house in a good five. I haven't seen one car. We haven't seen a car, haven't seen a house. I haven't seen a rabbit. I haven't seen anything. There's nothing. How are you feeling, Mom Jet? Scared man. Is yeah. the car locked, yeah? The car's locked. <laughs> Don't wanna go. Oh shit. Oh shit, there's a fox. Hard turn the fucking car back now. Hard! <laughs> are you scared? Lord, the location's right there, bro, no. I know. Hard, hard turn it back. No. There's no turning now, we're here. Here we are, guys. You, you wanna film or do you want me to film? I'll film. Can I be filming? Maybe we should cover the day. No. <laughs> we have to do it. We have to do it. I know. You look like you're waving a plane down. <laughs> Planes! Give me a fucking light! <laughs> Sorry. I don't. Why? I'm really scared now. <laughs> Anyone could be in here. Yep. That's the enjoyment, bro. I want to go home. <laughs> I want to go home now. <laughs> yeah, actually. Yes. Really like you said you said at any point if someone doesn't feel uneasy, we go back. No, I said you go back. I'll give you the keys. Oh. I don't know. Like I genuinely don't think it's up this way. I don't think it is this way. Like, it's next to the road. Yeah. That I saw that in the picture. It's Let's next to the road. I think we walk left from the car and go that way. Because I genuinely, it's not up here. Because it was super close to the road. And they said there was no pathway to it. Yeah, so it was a cottage. Yeah. That doesn't make sense. That's a walk, guys. That's a freaking walk. All a a three yard loop. A loop of pit lake loop or a Oh, yard. I get it. So up. that's a walk. Am I? <laughs> Gonna go back. I don't know, dude. I wish we came here like an hour earlier. We so need to. We need to go back. Yeah, we're roaming around like on donkeys, and we need to come back in the morning. Suss, cut the camera. Or keep it. Keep it rolling. Suss it. Suss it out. Come back next week. <laughs> Did you hear that? <laughs> Did you hear that? <laughs> Oh uh, man! Listen to how quiet. I just stand still. Yeah, oh, stand still. I don't want to stand still. <laughs> Yo, this is whack. I hate when this ha this happened last time too. Unfortunately, man, we just got that late. That fucking pizza. <laughs> Okay guys, so we have a little bit of a problem. My friend last night, he got a little bit scared. We couldn't find it because it was so dark. Couldn't find the haunted house. It was off a path that we couldn't find. So I went on Google Maps this morning, found it, 
perfectly, we know exactly where it was, we were actually basically beside it, but we have to go through a forest and we didn't know this. So now we're going to go there in the daytime and then wait to night time and film. Basically. And a cut. <laughs> That's where we were parked last night. Oh, here's the house. Bro, I wasn't even near that. Like, I didn't see that. Like, I wasn't even close to seeing that last night. Okay guys, so we went and scouted the house out. Um, just outside it, I haven't went inside yet, and we come back to the car and decide we'll wait in the car until it gets dark and then we'll go. Because we went last night as you've seen and we didn't get to see it, we didn't get to go even near it, didn't even know where it was, and I couldn't see it in the darkness. Like even with torches we could not see it. I'll be honest, this is the most scared I've been. I, I feel like when I was up there there were some weird noises, the trees were rustling, I know that's just normal, but to me there was like a weird energy, I don't know, I don't know how to explain it, but I do not feel comfortable right now. There's a car coming, but I do not feel comfortable at all because we've been sitting looking at this house, <clears throat> as you can tell. We've been sitting looking at this house for 10, 15 minutes now, just staring at it. And the, the more you look at it and the darker it gets, the creepier everything gets, doesn't it? Yeah. It really does. It does. <sighs> Guys, we have no signal. This is not good. What if something happens and we can't call anybody? What if the car doesn't start? What if we get stuck? <laughs> just trying to scare Dan. Look how it's like cloudy and like kind of misty. It's not really misty, but it's mostly cloudy. Mm. Hi. Whoa. What? What? Ah, yeah. So when I look up, yeah, I thought that this light just turned itself on. But it's because I got this cap, I couldn't see the light. <laughs> and then you looked up and freaked yourself out. <laughs> so I thought someone turned the light on. <laughs> yeah, reached in behind you. Yeah. Okay guys, so while we're waiting for it to get dark, we're gonna play rock, paper, scissors. I don't know why. <laughs> rock, paper, scissors, shoot. <laughs> Say rock, paper, scissors, and then shoot. Rock, rock paper, paper, scissors, scissors shoot, shoot. Ah, Wait, I did a really weird gesture. <laughs> okay. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Ah, oh, you bollocks, that's too new for you. So, f first of five? Yeah, okay. Rock, rock paper, paper, scissors, shoot. Rock, rock paper, paper, scissors, scissors shoot. shoot. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Stop doing that! <laughs> no. I don't know what I'm doing. If you're doing this, rock, paper, scissors. <laughs> <laughs> I it's, it's not intentionally. I didn't okay. mean it intentionally. Just. Okay. Rock, paper, <laughs> Stop. I don't know what I'm supposed to do. What am I supposed to do? Okay. okay. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. So, today guys, I'm going to teach you how to become mentally prepared for ghost hunting. <laughs> Basically, what you want to do is... <laughs> oh, I chose my camera that doesn't have zoom. Okay, so it's just about dusk now. We're walking up to the house. Um, gonna go inside, explore a little bit. Car coming. Oh. <laughs> it's <scared. That's> <laughs> Bro, I didn't get you in camera, I don't think. Oh yeah, like a knife torch. <laughs> yeah, that's what I was trying to do. <laughs> Pro. Commando Pro. Commando <laughs> Pro. Oh, just got him. <laughs> Before we go in, I'm going to go over just quickly again. A uh, wee recap for y'all. What went down in this house? It was in the 1800s and a family was cursed here by a demon, basically, or a ghost or whatever it was. And they're actually, this is the one of the only places in Ireland that has had an exorcism done, apparently. Um, so we're just going to go see that and see what's in there and see if it has been. Uh, I don't really know if it has. Dude, it's getting so much darker now, isn't it? 
Um, yo, let's just go in, get creeped out a little bit, see what's good. I don't really believe that there's anything here. I do have a weird eeriness around me, and I feel like people are watching me, but I think that's just because we're doing this. But yeah, okay, let's go. Where, we were, where the car is, mm -hmm. and we're walking over here. You know, and there's a few fun and games, but now it's just suddenly got darker. Yeah, bro, wasn't it? It, like, it just dropped. See, when we walked up this lane, bro, bro, wait, dude, bro, why is the camera not focusing? Dude, at all? Look, I see, when I look in the house, it doesn't focus, and it focuses on. Oh, it doesn't focus on you either. Oh, but now. Oh, yeah, it focuses on you. Oh, okay. So, oh, no. I don't like that. I don't like that. Mate, why is it so dark? Right, no, no, no. Alright, come on. Dude, look. It will not focus on the house and it focuses on you. Look. Bro. It won't focus. But on you. Boom. Okay. Dude, it's not focusing. Yep. No. Perhaps it's blowed out by Google. I think Google might blow it out. Yeah, this is freaking me right out. Do you know, do you know what cameras like do this? Like, they have the power to like drain your batteries and things. Oh my god. Yo, what is that? Oh, it's probably a bat. It's a bat, it's a bat, it's a bat. It's a bird or a bat? Bro. Why is there a pentagram? An upside down one as well. Bro. Okay. Let's go around the house first. Anybody here? Hello? No? Okay. Coming in. Please don't stab me if there's someone homeless in here. Oh my days. Oh, oh my days, dude. Dude, 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 dude. I want you to feel this, right? Stand. Stand right here. And put your arm through. Put your arm through. Don't go. Okay. Just your arm. Is tell this, me what you feel. Is something gonna grab it? No, just put your arm through and tell me Bro. what you feel. Yo, oh, yo, Dude. it's so cold. Yeah, I know. What? It's like warm where we're standing, and then in there's freezing, dude. Mate, that is so weird. Yo, oh. Bro, it's, it's, <laughs> dude, what? It's, it's ice in here. Mate, it's so cold in here. Oh, God, a bird or something. Bro, it's ice, dude. I've chills down my spine. Dude, what the flip? Why did we come? I don't think we should have been here, to be honest. Oh my god. 
I don't think we should. Honestly. What's this say? We are watching. Does it say that? There? In the left seat, we are watching. It says Corona up there. Put <laughs> condoms here. And. Big. Chungus? Chungus? I think that's a Fortnite skin. <laughs> oh, man. Dude, 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 I just felt something watch me. Oh, my dick, dude. There was something. Dude, I don't know what that was. I felt something. On, uh, oh, I don't know, dude. There was just something looking over me. Hey, mate. You got beef? No, Dan, Dan, camera off. I felt something looking at me. Like, like, seriously. Just in case you think I'm joking. I felt something looking at me, camera down. I mean it. I'm being dead serious, huh? Is, does it feel warm still in there? It does. Yeah. Ge genuinely through the threshold of that door, it feels warmer. Yeah, I felt. That's, I'm gonna go explore a little bit more if you just follow me around. Well, I know I keep saying hello, but don't answer me. Oh, dude. It's an upstairs. It's an upstairs? It's an upstairs. Bro, I don't know, but I feel very uncomfortable. Like, genuinely feel very uncomfortable, though. To be honest with you. Dude, I have, a, I have like, the sorest head. To be honest with you, this, this is, like... I don't know the right word for it, but it's not as... It's not as bad. That's the last one, but at the same time, after seeing that in that room, I don't want to go in that room again. And yeah, after and feeling this is, that. This is worse than the last one, I think. I have been super I think. Like, genuinely, dude, I don't, I don't, I don't, I'm, like, the last one I enjoyed, I'm not enjoying this right now at all. Like, at all, that. Look at that. Look at the spikes coming out of that. Mate. Oh! 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 <laughs> Chill. Bro. <laughs> Bro. <laughs> I am not enjoying this at all, bro. I forgot, like, there's a f weird feeling I've got, dude. I mean it with all my heart. It's a weird feeling. I do not want to be here much longer. <laughs> then, we'll come back down, take one last look around, okay? And then go. Because I don't like it. Okay. Okay, guys. Um. Get on it, but I feel like I'll fall through because there's holes everywhere. Um, bro, this is like, this is not like, are you genuinely don't feel bad here at all? Uh, I feel a bit, I feel a bit iffy, but Dude, I don't know. I'm, I must probably all be in my head. I don't know, it must be in my head. psychologically thinking. Ah, bro, dude. bro, what is that? It's, oh, it's a bat. It's a bat. <laughs> now I'm head nearly. I'm gonna go into this room one more time because I felt like there was the most like energy in here, like the creepiest energy. And then we got like here the spots. Yeah. Dude, that actually genuinely has a difference in temperature. Like that's crazy. And then the fact that there's a pentagram. Isn't it a pentagram? Yeah. I don't know, is it, is it a pentagram or a pentagon? No, pentagon's the... the shit. Oh! <laughs> I think that's... that's strange. It's so quiet. It's eerie. It's super eerie. It's so cold in this room. I felt like... as soon as I walked out of that place... Anxiety feeling is just gone. Yeah, I don't know. But like the area still, I'm getting a weird sensation about the area. Like when I was in there, I felt my head getting sore. I felt like just, just completely uneasy. Like genuinely, genuinely just uneasy. And I don't know. I feel like maybe it was just in my head, and I was like, you know, feeling it like that. But I don't know. I haven't felt like that like anywhere before. Like this, this like. I don't know, it's like a weird energy. I think when you go to these places, the first thing you think of is, you know, all the movies you've watched. Yeah. And all the stories you hear. 100% But it's crazy to think that someone lived in here once. 
Bro, there's a shadow. What the flip's that shadow? Give me the camera, give me the camera, give me the camera. Is it us? No! Bro... It's me. Oh, okay. What the flip? Okay. It's... Uh, like, it's, it's... It's our torches. Okay. Okay. <laughs> okay. We're, we're just being stupid now. Uh, yeah, so that's us done. We're walking away from the house now. Um, I I just did not feel comfortable. I'm not happy with today. Um, I kind of want to leave. I wanted to leave since I kind of entered the house. Like, walking around it when we first went up to it was fine. Keep shining in front of me, I can't see anything. It's fine. <laughs> Getting a bit freaked out though. Oh, okay. Um, oh, what? It's a slug. Oh. Oh. I almost stood on him. Dude, that house looks so creepy from back here. It's strange how dark it's gone. Like, All of a sudden. How far it's gone. I know. Thank you so much for watching guys, please hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, comment down below for all the videos you want us to react to, react to, that's my other channel, <laughs> go check out my reaction channel, and yeah, I will see you next week for another haunted video, see ya.